Good morning. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I eat in a day as somebody who is on a fitness journey, prioritizing high protein, low calorie meals, and meals that are healthy, simple, satiating, and good for people who really don't like cooking. I am all about eating meals that are quick to make and simple and are based off of a lot of clean and healthy ingredients. I was actually vegan for three years, but last year I decided to go back to eating meat just because my body was literally craving it. And so I was like, well, my body's telling me what to eat so I should follow the signals and the signs and since then I've noticed that I have so much more energy especially eating a high protein based diet so today I have some homework to do because I'm in online school so I have to read and catch up on homework and all of that stuff and then I want to get editing done as well Every morning, as you saw, I start off with pre-workout snack. And then for breakfast, I am eating literally what I eat every single day, which is just eggs, avocado, sweet potatoes, and turkey bacon. This never fails to keep me full throughout the morning. And it's really simple and easy to make. It literally takes me 20 minutes every morning. And I like eating the same breakfast because I don't have to think too hard about what I'm eating that day. And that keeps things simple for me, especially since I am on a calorie deficit. I used to have a really complicated relationship with food where I just felt like I was always thinking about what I was gonna eat. And switching to a high protein diet where I'm eating foods that are really satiating and and just holding me over for a long time has completely changed the game and I feel like I really am on the journey to healing my relationship with food. So I'm gonna go eat this and yeah, I'll talk to you guys in a few. There is a certain point during the day where my brain just taps out and I can no longer function and I am at that point. I literally feel like I have no energy left and that's how I know I need to eat. So let's go make lunch.
love having tuna for lunch because it takes basically no time to make. I just whip out the ingredients and throw it all together and it's done in like five minutes. And it's actually really filling and pretty low in calorie if that's something that you're concerned about. I'm so hungry. But you can also make tuna salad. So you can put tuna on top of salad and put whatever toppings you like, dressing you like, and I've heard that's really good. I haven't tried that, but I know a lot of people who love it. I actually like to take a break during lunch. So for now, I'm just gonna watch a podcast or a YouTube video and just kind of relax, eat my lunch and allow myself to charge up again. It is a bit later, but I'm still feeling a little bit hungry. And some days are just like that, especially the days when I'm going to the gym. So I'm gonna make a little snack. And the snack that I'm gonna make is just a little yogurt bowl. So I buy the Oikos Triple Zero Vanilla Yogurt. And what I'll do is get a granola bar. This is the dark chocolate flavored coating and peanut butter protein bar from Lidl. This one's not really that great of a protein bar if you're looking for like a protein bar, but it is kind of good if you just need a little crunch. Okay, so now that we've got our snack, let's get back to work. I finally just got done with working. I did schoolwork, I had therapy, and I finished editing a video. And honestly, now I am so tapped out and I'm starving, but I'm waiting on my partner to get home before I start dinner. I'm just gonna relax. Maybe I'll read until she gets home. It's actually quite cozy outside right now. It started raining and it's super dark out and I have a candle going. Now I am just excited for dinner and to relax for the rest of the night. So this is your reminder that simple meals don't have to taste bad. They are really good and food doesn't have to be a stressful thing. So anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it.